My intellect is without limit. Back back, Two Phase MTG. So today we're going to play Mono Red, but this is not the typical Mono Red. This is not Agro Mono Red. This is Chandra's Big Red Machine Mono Red. So I've been looking for a way to get Chandra Heart of the Fire some gameplay, trying to figure out a good build to put her in. And I tried a lot of different decks and I just, she felt awkward in all of them. But this deck, this list, she finally feels good. She finally feels more natural. She feels smooth to play with in this build. So let's get into this. This is Chandra's big red machine, mono red. So I'm running four shock. You know, I think the algorithm when playing this deck, when I was first assembling this list, I think it put me on a aggro deck because I'm mono red. So I was facing a lot of different aggro builds with this deck. So a lot of those matchups I ended up cutting out of my, my videos because I didn't want all my gameplay to just be all aggro. So I, I did leave some in, but I, I don't I didn't want all my gameplay to be all aggro. So I think as I continued to play this deck, I started to, the, the algorithm started to get some matchmaking smoothing for me. So I started seeing a lot of different builds. Um I'm, I will be honest, there is one deck that you will probably have trouble with above all else, and that is cycling, because we don't have a way to, to get rid of a uh, uh, flare. So we usually just, with this deck, we'll just end up just dying to flare. But hey, that's the price you pay. Not everybody's playing cycling, but I did, I did want to point that out, that out of all the decks that I played against, uh, cycling was the one that that seemed like it it would be the most problem for this build above anything else. Um, I'm running one Shandra's Regulator, only one, but this card is great when you do get it. But it's one of those cards that's just like it's not essential to the deck, so it really doesn't matter if you don't get it. But when you do get it, when you do, it's great. It 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 being able to get to copy. Chandra's ability can be backbreaking for the opponent. So just the one copy. Four lava coil, typical spot removal. Um, actually, this is great spot removal because it exiles, which is very relevant in the current meta. Four bone crush giant, doubles his spot removal and a body. Great card. We we definitely definitely want the four copies of that in this deck. Uh four flame spill. I really like this card. It also serves dual purpose because it serves spot removal and it serves as damage to the face so this card is perfect in this deck for iron crag feet this helps us ramp up into our bigger game ending threats that we have in the deck uh four storm no excuse me i cut it down to three three storms wrath four felt like too many we are running chandras we're running multiple uh kinds of chandras so we don't want to be drawn into a whole bunch of storms wrath a lot of times what will happen is we want a Storm's Wrath to go ahead and clear off anything that we haven't been able to spot remove before we get to Chandra. So we don't we don't want to be sitting with a bunch of Storm's Wraths in our hand because once we play Chandra's, we don't want to be casting Storm's Wrath. So only playing the three copies of Storm's Wrath, uh, three Chandra Heart of the Fire, uh, the main reason for me trying to, you know, assemble this deck. She feels, like I said, she feels really natural in this deck. Um, in other decks... Her plus one felt kind of awkward. It still can feel kind of awkward, but you got to get used to playing this build. A lot of times, once you play her, you'll be down to like one or two cards in your hand, and those cards will be relevant, so you won't want to discard them. So you, a lot of times, you'll just use her as a shock. She'll be a five-mana shock. But once you do empty your hand out, the, the plus one, the first plus one is just all gas. So especially if you have Regulator out, now you're exiling the top six cards. And that, that can be very difficult for your opponent to overcome. That's way too much card advantage for your opponent to just to just take lightly. So uh, running three of her, running two Chandra Awakened Inferno. We all have seen her before. She's very strong. She's a solid finisher. And the rest of the deck is pretty much just built on removing our opponent's stuff. So this Chandra can sit there and just plus two, plus two, plus two, and those emblems start adding up. And if you got five drop Ch Chandra down, she's shocking them to the face every turn. So the damage starts adding up really quickly. I know it may seem like, just looking at it on the on the surface, it may seem like it takes a long time, but trust me, it doesn't. Uh, two Sunder and Stroke. This game can, this, this card can just end the game out of nowhere. 
uh, iron crag feet into sundering stroke. It can clear the board and it can finish off our opponent. So it serves dual purpose in this deck. Uh, Yadaro, also great to just cheat out with iron crag feet. They, uh, Yadaro is kind of like they have to remove him. They have to. If they don't remove him, then they just die. He can just kill them on, on his own. So that's pretty much the, the main deck. Then I'm running 25 Mountains. Uh, sideboard for best of three, of course. I'm running three me uh, Red Cap Melee for you know going against other Mono Red Aggro decks. Uh, four Flame Sweep also for Mono Red Aggro decks or just Aggro decks in general. Uh, I have two Krinko in here, two Fe uh, Phoenix of Ash, two Tibalt, and two Sarkon the Masterless. Um, these pretty much come in as additional finishers, of course. The bulk comes in against heavy life gain decks, but the rest of these are just um, added finishes to be able to, to put into the deck uh, when you're going against control or um, mid rangey style decks. Of course, you want to bring in Krinko and Tibalt when you're going against life gain, so always keep that in mind. You definitely want those in the sideboard for that. And Sarkon is just, like I said, an added uh, win kind. We, we already run in two different Chandra's in the deck. Um, if you bring him in with Tabalt, then that's four walkers in the deck. So Sarkon being in the deck is completely justified at that point. Um, even with just the two Chandras, it's justified. So, yeah, this deck is, it's just fire, man. It's just fire. Sometimes you just want to see the world burn. Some men just want to watch the world burn. And that's what we're doing with this deck. So let's get into the action. Go. Carbo 22. Oh, some some mono red versus mono red action going, huh? All right, let's go ahead and shock that. Get out of here. Let's see whose red is better. I'm gonna try to steal some of my fire. I'm trying to rob my fire. Get him out of here too. I don't like thieves. Thieves are bad for society. Another one. Man, he, he likes stealing my stuff. I guess he don't have enough fire. He wants to steal my fire. <laughs> Alright. Um, go ahead and use this. Save the lava coil. In case he drops an annex. Got it. Thinking. Alright. Um, I don't, I don't care. I'm gonna go ahead and use the coil. I hate Steamkin just that much. Got. Come on, man. I'm winning. I'm winning the fire race here. You're just lighter fluid. I'm jet fuel. Alright. Go ahead and shock that. Get my bone crusher down. It's not uh not looking too good for you there, mate. Nah, that, ain't, that ain't gonna get it. <laughs> Alright, let me go ahead and uh I wanna do no, I'm gonna go ahead and just flame spill. Uh oh. I'm taking the lead in this. In this fire matchup here. That ain't that ain't gonna get it either. Alright. Go ahead and seven damage to you and Torbrand. Finish you off with my with my bone crusher here. Easy pickings. Superior red. Let's go, let's go. No username. <laughs> Guess he's like, uh, you guys ever seen the Venom movie? He's like, you'll just be an armless, legless, faceless thing rolling down the street in the wind. That's, that's no username up there. <laughs> he's an armless, legless, faceless thing. 
who's now gaining three life. This is some ores off life gain. Oh, the charming guy. Very handsome. I don't I don't like him being around. I, I want to be the only handsome guy here, so me let me go ahead and stomp him out of here. It can only be one. I'm him right now. Well, my bone crush is kinda handsome. He's got the shiny bald head and everything going for him, so. Oh! Emperor Palpatine. Alright, well, let me see if he blocks with Emperor Palpatine. I don't suspect he will. Alright, gotta gotta shock him off the field. Gotta give gotta give Palpatine that lightning. Since <laughs> he always seems to die by lightning. His own lightning. Oh. Back to being the only handsome guy. Alright. Well Shandro's Shandro's fine with it. Me and her are dating right now. He's very faithful to me. I'm so handsome. <laughs> what are you looking in your graveyard for? Oh man. Palpatine's back. Well, let me go ahead and play uh Big Chandra. Get him get him back out of here. I'm just gonna get beat up by Chandra's now. <laughs> I guess he didn't want none of it. And roll with it. Two lander. I drew a land, so I'm good. Another ore is off deck. Or brownie. Oh. Griffin Ari. I like that. That's a nice draft card. I've I've drafted with that a few times. Pretty good. Uh oh. What are you gonna take? I suspect he's gonna be probably take my Chandra. Probably what I would take. Decisions. I'd be surprised if we take anything else. Oh, Sundry Stroke. Alright. Well he's probably got answers for Chandra, so wait, what are you doing? Get out of here. What are you doing? You just seen I just had a shock in my hand. Yes, maybe he was baiting. Maybe that was bait. Maybe he's got something worse. Worse than the, the hawk. I need fried meat. Alright, well, let me go ahead and coil him. I suspect this is another, yeah, Palpatine deck. <laughs> let me go ahead and cycle this. I need a land. Please let me get a land. Oh, it's not a land. Oh. Well, that's it. That's an expensive one life. <laughs> Alright. Well, let me go ahead and exile Palpatine. Bye, Palpatine. Oh, man. You gonna, you gonna take Chandra this time? Got two of them. All right, taking my removal. Man, my dog is sad. Oh yeah, I gotta land. All right, go ahead and get Chandra down. <clears throat> I suspect this is just gonna be a five minute shot because I think he has removal for us since he didn't he didn't pull it from my hand. So I I think he can remove at least one of them. Yeah. All right. All right, let me go ahead and play another one. Man, these some expensive shocks. Five mana shocks. Oh man. Well, I guess that's why you left them in my hand. Oh, the. What in the world? All right. Go ahead and shock your face. Get bone crusher down. 
Hotly. Haven't seen her in a while. Alright, uh... We'll just... We go ahead and attack him. Not gonna worry about Hotly. She ain't doing nothing. She's just chilling over there. See if he makes me pay for that. Oh, Palpatine. Oh. Uh, go ahead and play my Godzilla. I like that. I like that Hotly trick there. Let me uh, kill her. And swing forward to... Wait a minute. Hold on. No. I'm just going to swing all at him because he's obligated to block. His life gain ain't gonna be able to out outrace the damage. And as suspected, he doesn't want Palpatine to die, so. You gonna use your Hotly trick again? Make another token? It's a cool trick. I wanna see it again. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. What are you waiting for? If you're taking this long, you didn't draw anything that relevant because you would have auto-jammed it. <laughs> Come on, man. Share in our strength. I like that trick. Let me do a deck with that. Go ahead and get Palpatine out of here. Oh, man, wait a minute. I should have removed the token. Because he's at seven. Palpatine would have only gained him one life. Oh well. So he'll be at one now. If I, if I remove the token, he, he'd be at exactly zero. Alright, I gave him another turn. That was a that was a stacks mistake. Oh, it didn't cost me. <laughs> Delicious. Delicious. My opponent is delicious. Playing some what appears to be mono green. We're gonna have to start some forest fires. Well, go ahead and start by roasting some snake. Barbecue snake. Mmm. Yummy. I like snake. I've eaten snake before. Barbecue, actually. Go ahead and barbecue some giant jolly green. Jolly green beans. Fresh off the grill. Oh. I guess he wants to add roasted questing beast to the menu <laughs> all right um <laughs> go ahead and fricassee your your questing beast starting all the forest fires better go get yogi bear only you can prevent forest fires <laughs> anything else Oh, that's a, that's a big paradise druid. Uh, I'm not gonna play my bone crusher. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep him I'm gonna keep him in exile. So when I play my Chandra, I can roast his <laughs> roast the field and kill his his uh his druid. Oh, he's gonna be. Gaining some of that life to counteract the roasting from Chandra. Not gonna, not gonna save you though. Alright. Get rid of your druid. These fireworks. Yeah. Fourth of July is coming up, Chandra. We need those fireworks. Lots of them. Alright. Go ahead and, uh, bust. And uh, get my bone crush down, and I'm gonna cycle 
this. All right. In good position here. Fires are burning. The trees. They're on fire. My opponent's on fire. <laughs> Go ahead and uh, smack for a lot here. Is it just me, or is it getting a little warm in here? Pretty warm, Chandra. <laughs> My opponent's on fire. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> You're on fire. It's delicious. You're on fire. Good game. <laughs> uh, oh man, this is definitely not the best of hands. Probably should not keep this, but if I can manage to draw into some action, this will actually be in a, a pretty good hand. So I'm going to risk it. I'm going to risk it here. Hello. On it. Oh. Hello and duress. That's, uh, that's one heck of a hello. Coolie. <laughs> Coolio. Coolie whip. Alright. Taking my lava coil. Oh. I did not need another one of those. Land flooded. Hopefully I can pick up some action here before he starts doing his, whatever his Rakdos plan is up here. What's your plan, Coolio? Cooley. Oh! Gabriel! Dealing with you <laughs> a mind is a terrific All right. thing to wait. I haven't seen Dabriel since I was playing him, but you don't see him too often. Oh, Croxa. Is this my deck? Discard my spill. This appears to be my deck. Cooley, are you a subscriber of mine? <laughs> um, well, I'm going to go ahead and do seven, seven damage to Dabriel and... Seven damage to Cooley. Can't do anything else. Might as well. I don't want Davriel to start shooting me with those hollow tips. Cooley! Oh yeah. <laughs> this is definitely my deck. I have arrived! <laughs> you haven't arrived as a YouTuber until people until you run into people playing your decks. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll go ahead and play Regulator. Since this is my deck, I'm pretty confident in saying that I will not win this. <laughs> For those of you that did not see my last video, this is the deck that I displayed. <laughs> yeah, that, that Angrouse Rampage pretty much confirms it, so. I will link the video from yesterday in the description of this video. If you wish to see the deck that Cooley is displaying here. <laughs> wonder if he's a subscriber of mine. I wonder if he's like, yeah, I'm playing against Dax Rockman with his own deck and I'm winning. <laughs> oh man, I'm like royally land flooded. Well, at least I'm losing to my own deck. Gonna play Crocs now? That's what I would do. Yeah. <laughs> this has been a waste of my time. Oh man, I'm just drawing all bad stuff. Well, Cooley, whoever you are, <laughs> you you beat me with my own deck. I'm famous now. I've officially made it. I'm being defeated by players playing my decks. Oh, yeah. I've made it. I'm a YouTube star. 
<laughs> a good game, man. Well done. Well done. All right. Back to back to business here after losing to my own deck. And some Simic here. Is this going to be Simic Flash or Ugin Simic Ramp? Looks like some Ugin Rampness. All right, get my regulator down. I love when I draw regulator. Only plan to one of, but when I get it, puts in work. You holding up mana to counter stuff? That's what it appears to be. I'm gonna flash something in. This flash? Okay, well, let me go ahead and kill your druid. Set your mana back. <laughs> Wish you would have saved that for counter spells, don't you? So now I know I gotta be, I gotta be mindful of counters now. So he must be, this must be Flash. This must be Simic Flash. This isn't, this isn't Ugin Ramp. All right. That's fine, we ain't worried about your crisis. Not worried about the crisis. Go ahead and uh, get, Chandra down now. I would like to I would have liked to save it and play it for when he when he has a counter or mana open for counter spell, but just to hurt his feelings to know he can't counter it. Alright, and do one then pay my one mana to copy it. Yeah, regulator. So good. Hold up counter magic. No, you want to. Well, you go ahead and plus on Chandra. Copy. I'm just gonna burn him up with Chandra. I'm not even gonna worry about playing anything. Let him sit there and just want to counter things and I won't play anything. He's Chandra. Snorting. <laughs> Yeah, come on, counter man. This is not a battle you're going to win. You don't have uh, no agent. Can't steal my Chandra. <laughs> it's like, man, I want to hold up counter magic so bad. I don't want him to play anything. I don't want him to resolve anything. I want to counter it. All right. I'll just sit here and continue to plus Chandra. Let me discard one of these. Don't need two of them. All right. Plus. Auto pay. Response. Got a response? Uh oh. Oh. So he's got mana open. I want to roast it. Oh, okay. Well, in response, I'll roast it now. <laughs> Fish. Like grilled, grilled merfolk. All right. He doesn't want to. He doesn't want to be be put on fire by Chandra. He's just smoldering right now. Hold on. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> He's smoldering. <laughs> Alright. Just let you smolder for now. And he's in he's intent on holding up counter magic. Not gonna save you, man. Alright. Are your one card. Exile your crisis. 
Wait, plus on Chandra. <laughs> now you're on fire. <laughs> You're not smoldering anymore now, you're on fire. Oh. There we go. <laughs> on fire. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and keep it. Good hand. Uh oh. Platinum. Tier 1. Yurion Sky Nomad. Alright. Means I can't play around. I gotta I gotta play for real. No messing around this match. Not gonna make not gonna make diamond on me, buddy. Vop 2. I'm not gonna be free entry into diamond for you. What is this? This uh Teamer, go ahead and uh, get rid of your elemental here. Is this, this Teamer Reclamation? Ugin Ramp? He's playing, is he playing Yurion? I'm almost certain that this is going to be a Ugin build. Alright, let me get my bone crush down. Start working on that life total. Yeah, they, they like to exile everything with with uh Ugin and then play Urion and reset Ugin. That's the trick they go for. Alright. Um go ahead and attack. I don't think he'll be blocking. Go ahead and uh lava coil your druid. Gotta keep him off his mana. Delay him getting the Ugin. Oh! Sad robot. Man, I should've I should have saved that lava coil. I want him I don't want him getting card draw for sad robot. Uh oh. Alright. Go ahead and kill sad robot now then. But he can't have him as a blocker. Alright, he's got six mana. Alright, uh go ahead and get this one down. Swing in. Gotta try to outrace this Ugin. We got Uh oh, Nissa. That's bad. What are you waiting for? Alright. Gotta get this off the field. So I think... I think, uh... I'm gonna shock, shock Nissa. So one giant kills her. And then I'm gonna... Let me let me let me swing in first. Kill Nissa. Four to the face. <clears throat> then I'm gonna I'm gonna flame spill the land. That'll put him back down to six land. Alright. Good position. Good good position here. More Vop 2. Making you work for that diamond. Dax ain't gonna just give up diamond. If you wanna rank up against me, you're gonna earn it. Forgive me. Alright. Keeps on gaining three life here. Keeping him in the game. Uh oh. That's seven mana now. Eight. Nine. <laughs> Let me cycle this. <laughs> Oh man, he's gonna be on Ooh next turn. All right. Um, let me, do I want to play this now? Well, let me see how he blocks. Let me see if he blocks with the with the Uro. All right. He didn't block with the Druid. 
Maybe that means he doesn't have Ugin. Alright, let me go ahead and play... I'm gonna play the big Chandra. And, uh, minus two. Uh, well, should I use... Well, no, the, the minus three doesn't kill the elemental, so... Yeah, let me just go ahead and... Minus two here. So... I play the big Chandra over the, the smaller Chandra, because if he plays Ugin, then he's Ugin's gotta go go down to one to exile Chandra. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright. Alright. I can always well, that Ugin's gonna die. Chandra kills him. Still in a good position here. Alright, go ahead and shock Ugin. Chandra, killing Ugin. <laughs> Chandra, roasting Ugin. Oh! Oh no! Oh man. Back to back Ugin. Alright. Well. The Godzilla kills him, though. So. Coming down to the wire here. Bop 2. He's trying to earn it. He's trying to earn it, man. And Make me earn it. Go ahead and kill you, Ugin. Go ahead and... Some of your Urion. <laughs> Death has never stopped me. Stopping you today. <laughs> Stopping you today, Ugin. Alright. Wanna block? Of course you will. <laughs> oh man, I hope he doesn't top deck another Ugin. That would be the top deck of a lifetime. Yes. Yay. Good game. <laughs> uh, face. No diamond for you. <laughs> yeah. Break up. And that's how you make the MTG multiverse burn. Just make it burn. <laughs> As always, I hope you all enjoyed it. I appreciate everybody. If you are not subscribed, you should subscribe and hit that bell. Um, draft box giveaway coming up on this weekend's video. And I will be giving away some arena codes for people who comment on this video. So make sure you leave a comment. I will be selecting people at random that comment on this video and giving out um, 20, M2021 codes. Um, so yeah, definitely comment on this video. And again, if anybody has any deck ideas, let me know because I'm taking all submissions right now. Uh, thank you, everybody, and I will see you all next time.